Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages. More dredge. I am dredging to the depths. It is morning. Let's see. Where were we going to go today? Mm-hmm. We can now crawl again because we have the net up. That's good. It's a fathomless winch. Not a fathomless winch. Although I have known women that I couldn't understand. They might be you could insultingly call them uh, fathomless wenches. Uh, let's see. I think we finished off the Gale Cliffs. I don't know if we've ever actually gone there. And that is a location where we can um, rest. So I think we'll head and see if there's anything here to be done. And then head over here. We need one more. We need a, a, a number of different fish for the old fortress. Good evening to whomever has joined me. We can go to the research outpost, and that will uh, suppress the monster that lives in the central lagoon. So we're going to head due south. Do we have something to drop off at Blackstone Isle? I don't think so. Uh, no, but we do have emerald earrings. We can drop those off right across the way. And that'll be fine. <clears throat> it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. <coughs> a beautiful day for a neighbor. Would you be mine? Could you be mine? sell the item we've got for 55 bucks. Ah, we do want to um, deploy the trawling. There we go. And we'll also want to be able to drop a crab pot Somewhere out here in the deeper water when we get there. <coughs> so we're headed in the correct direction. Curious kind of fish here. I can, and that is something I don't think I've previously caught. I have not caught a viper fish. I'm pretty sure I need a viper fish somewhere. There are a number of places I have to drop off fish. I think? Viperfish. Encyclopedia Viperfish. Hovering in wait above the seafloor, these long fish bite and attempt to swallow whatever random prey they encounter. But, more importantly, is it a viperfish? The... Nope, that's not for that one. No, it's not the viper fish there. All right. I don't think they needed that one for the second trap either. I don't remember what that was, though, off the top of my semi-functional head. We've caught our first... Ooh, there is at least something on one of these islands here. Safe havens. I visited every dock in the game. Next to the dock is a derelict campsite. Strange symbols scratching the sand. What do you want to do? Inspect the symbols. Symbols oh, span the breadth of the camp, twisting this way and that. Some are grouped together in what must be words. Fresh footprints. Tread carefully around each symbol. The last symbol trails off hurriedly and looks unfinished. 
I'll inspect the last symbol. A glint of metal shines up through the land. Ah, sapphire ring. That's another, like, probably 50 bucks. Inspect the footprints. Whoever left the footprints was barefoot. The prints are large and wide, perhaps indicating they were left by a man, but you don't know much about footprints. Fresh footprints tread carefully on. Yeah, we got that. All right. Search it. I found an extremely rough and worn sheet of fabric has collapsed at the base of some wooden supports. There's nothing remarkable about it. What do you want to do? We'll leave for now. What the heck? Uh, okay, that's the. Check these little islands as well. Ah, I screwed that up. Ah, go short. Just because there's no other dock here doesn't mean there isn't something else to find. In this particular case, however, it, it appears that it means that there's nothing else to find. Well, oh, maybe not. Cultists. Or a cultist. What's he looking for? You approach the hooded figure. Dirty robes of gold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fisherman deep calls respond. The voice gargles with the sound of fluid in their lungs. Lovely, lovely. An answer. He holds out the first scroll. Uh, well, okay, I happen to have one of those, so... Sure. They rip through the throat of the fish and tear out its heart. It's in their mouth before you have time to process what you just saw. Another sacrifice. They pointed another shape in the scroll. I do not have a fang tooth. Unless this is a conveniently located fangtooth spawn. It's not. Alright, so we need to head over for Starlight Pontoon. Gonna get there after dark. Don't go out after dark. Have you learned nothing? Yeah, pretty much. No, mostly nothing. Uh, you know what we need. You know it helps light things up. Lights. Is that some sort of iridescent fishing spot? It's iridescent for sure. Is it a fishing spot? Looks like it. I have to. I have to. I have to try. Okay, I know what that is. That's one of the creepy things. Okay, that should be our spot. We made it. No problem at all. Hmm. Alright, I don't want to sell them all. I don't want to sell that one. I want to sell that one and that one. Um. So, what do we got? We do not have a new uh, book yet. Catch a fang tooth. Uh, that's more tablets. That's a cusky. I think those are rare, rare fish. None of those are appropriate. And I don't think that's any. What was the, the fish I had again? 
viper fish. So it doesn't look like that actually is, is wanted anywhere in particular. So I'll go ahead and sell that. And we'll no doubt end up regretting that. Mm. Oh, I didn't didn't sell air. Uh, did that sell all the stuff? Yeah, I did sell all the stuff out of my uh, my net. Right? Mm. Yeah, it did. Okay. Shipyard. Oh. We want to repair the trawling. Uh, and that should be it. We'll sleep. Hope your Saturday night's going great. Try some fishing out and around the outside. Uh, we want to be ready to drop a crab pot if we find any place interesting. That is uh, like an anglerfish. I think somebody wanted the anglerfish. She wanted an anglerfish. Well, we can head directly towards uh, the fortress then, right off the bat. We'll be able to turn that in for her. We'll see if we can catch anything else on the way. There's the fortress, dead ahead, on the other side of the island. Ooh, barracuda! Bum, bum, ba -dum, bum, bum, ba -dum. Sorry, sorry. Who can resist a heart reference? Ah, uh, it's that. Fangtooth, I need that for somebody. Red snapper. Boring. Fishing spots. We'll drop off the uh, anglerfish for the researcher. That is a hammerhead. Okay. Bunch of little fishies. He's lovely. A loose jaw. I don't know if that's one for one she needs. That might be two. I might be able to turn in two of the ones she needs in one go. It'll be like winning. Ish. Researcher. Hi there. About those specimens you're after. That's the last two she needs. I have good news and bad news. What you want to hear first? I actually saw somebody ask this the other day on stream. Asking the stream, which would you rather have? Someone says they have good news and bad news. What do you want to hear first? And the, everyone says bad news, so bad news. Bad news is the samples retrieved in the basin have dangerously high counts of cellular mutations. This surprises me not at all. The good news is that I've honed in on what's causing the abnormalities in the ecosystem. It all points to one thing. That thing in the basin is harmful to life at a cellular level. It damages everything around it, whether passively or with intent. I need to write up my report on my findings. Sorry, our findings, immediately. Maybe now they'll take me seriously. Oh, how rude of me. You've done all of this for me, and I've not got much to say thank you with. Um, you should have this. A big sloppy kiss? She opens a drawer, pulls out a book. Sheepishly, she hands it to you. This is something I wrote during my studies. I think it'll be useful to you. Thanks again for your help. I'd recommend that you avoid the area. It doesn't seem safe to be near the basin. I have a new book, I think. A plan for the future. Okay, so we are here. Oh, we can catch some more stuff. Hit the uh, Starlight Pontoon and sell. Let's see where we are. Wait, did I miss something? 
Ah, the encyclopedia the loose jaw with red searchlights below its eyes. This predator hunts with needle-like teeth. Its stomach can expand to hold prey larger than itself. Much like me. I'm kidding, of course. I, I, I can't hold anything larger than myself. Sometimes it feels like I can and possibly have. Wait, where was... There was another fish I had, the uh, fang tooth. Where was the fang tooth supposed to go? Fang tooth was going somewhere. Catch a fang tooth, the figure in gold. That's on the island that I was just at not very long ago. So that is over here. Take it to him, then. Got anything uh, interesting to catch here? No. Is that another boat? Oh, I think that's a wreck, and I've seen that before. Yeah, it is. fish that ought to be worth uh, a little bit of uh, change where was he he's on the other island he's on that island right I do believe no it's on I think this island I think the island must be this island I didn't think it was got myself turned all around. Oh, he was down like here. Yeah. Well, we'll use our teleport to get back to civilization then. We have a teleport. Yeah, we got some magic, man. Every little thing I do is magic, magic, magic. I apologize for singing at you. This is the wrong one. It's on the other island, I think. Not here. This is not the place, I don't think. A photographer? Uh. Uh, sorry. Would you step out of the way for a moment? You're in my shot. Move to the side. A few seconds later, the photographer sighs in exasperation and mutters to his uh. No, this simply won't do. What's the matter? The angle of the lens is all wrong. I'll never get a close-up shot of anything. And the others, I fear they were lost overboard. Uh. <sighs> she looks off to the west. I was sailing from Stellar Basin, you see, squeezing my boat through a narrow gap between two islands, and then I crashed into some coral. I thought I heard something in the water behind me, so I dared not stop. If you were able to retrieve the lenses for me, uh, let me see. Rummages through a few belongings. Survive the trip. I have a spare camera here that I don't need. You're welcome to it. If you can find those lenses. I'll mark on the map where I think I lost them. Right now. So I lost them there. Meanwhile, I'm trying to find the crazy guy. Here. I have managed to completely get myself lost, which is not great, if you think about it. Is this him? This is him. I did not get myself lost. Another sacrifice. They pointed another shape in the scroll, this one. They bring the small fish up to their mouth and bite it where its heart is. Their cracked lips part to reveal a row of sharpened teeth. Sense an opening. They unfurl the final scroll. It shows a blue crab. Got it. What we're going to do... We now have... We're 12% done with our book. We need to catch 
Doing crap for him. Uh, what's the teleport? Banish. The banishing words can dispel evil for most time. Ah, okay. uh, manifest. Poof. We're almost home. Never did drop the crab pot. That's fine. Got to be careful here. As rocks show up at unexpected times. There, are, there are no rocks here uh, during the day. Damn it. it! It it literally did jump out in front of me. Fishmonger, what do you got? 275 bucks. I don't think there's anything else I need there. All right. Uh, uh -huh. Shipwright, we need to fix our boat and the damage. Two more metal scraps. Pursuits. Oh, okay, I didn't click on it. It's late. Let's take a let's take a le wee little rest. You know, six hours ought to do. Where did I catch blue crabs? Now would be a good time to look that up because I need to catch one. Encyclopedia. Is there a way to look it up, like, alphabetically? Blue mackerel, cod. They're, they're not alphabetical. Looking for blue crab, right? There's really no way to look. Oh my god, guys. It's a total of like 137 different things to catch, I think. And we're looking for blue crab. Why are they not alphabetical or something? Oh my god. Devs, this is awful. This is painful. Writer, EB, has subscribed with their Prime. Thank you very, very much. Yeah, un unexpected. Very welcome. One of these days, I'm going to have to work up a spiel for uh, a subscription. I only have spiels for follows right now. Thank you very much. Hey, Vorp, how are you doing this evening? Uh, I just got a sub. And now I'm attempting to find out... Oh, I need, I need the snailfish somewhere. That's Hadal in Stellar Basin. I'll get back to that in a minute. Yeah. It's always nice. Always a pleasure. Right now, I'm looking to see where the hell I caught blue crab. And I'm not finding it anywhere. I guess because it's not considered a crab? I don't know. Thanks. It muchly appreciated. I mostly keep a relatively um, chill stream unless something really pisses me off, which actually happens a little bit more often than I would like, but 
I, uh, do do we not have crabs listed in our our catching book? Exotics. It doesn't look like it. All right. Well, we need um, a snailfish, and we caught that in Stellar Basin Hadal. We need that for uh, one of the things up here, I think. I wish that pursuits were a little more explicit than they are. It's morning. It's morning in America. Sorry. Couldn't help myself. I should have tried harder. Alright, we'll see if we can catch. That fish was in the Hadal area. So we're headed right back to basically where we were. Here. And the research outpost. Uh, this is a game that uh, makes it really easy to do a chill stream, too. As most of the time, it's fishing. And then you get to the cosmic horror bits. Oh, there's something over here. What was it again? It was uh, for the researcher. What am I doing for the researcher again? Blue crab, my relics, Castile, no, no, no. There was something I needed. Don't remember what it was. God, my brain is... It, it used to be pretty sharp. Used to be. the right place. We're pretty close. One of these two. Whatever it is we're looking for, this isn't it. A goblet. That's what I expect to do to catch when I go fishing. Oh, I will check that in a sec. That's a no. But we've got a, a little floaty bit here. That must be what we're looking for. Collection of cases have washed up on the shore. Some have already split open and lost their contents. Look for valuables. Photography equipment. Ah, oh, that was what I needed it for. It was the, for the photographer. Right. And she was over there. One of those three islands. The camp, I think. Just straight ahead. But we're here. We've got some bubbles, so some fish. We'll catch something creepy. Ghost shark. I'm not sure what I need a camera for. No, it wasn't on this island then. Must be over here. Nope, that's not her. That's not. That's the guy who's looking for that last fish. I found two fish for him. The creepy little fellow that he is. early. Is this the island she was at? The photographer? Must be, I hope. We've got some bubbling stuff. I could use a couple more pieces of scrap metal. Or another ring. A bag of doubloons. Now that sounds like that ought to be worth a lot. Spoiler, it's not worth that much. Photographer. You have the lenses. I do hope they've not been damaged by the seawater. She takes the case from you and inspects each lens. They seem mostly unharmed. Nothing that some careful polishing can't remedy, at least. As promised, you should take my spare camera. The lens is nothing special, but it should allow you to capture some good shots. If you wanted some advice on locating wildlife to photograph, just say the word. Tell me about large fish. 
I suspect you're more knowledgeable in this particular area than I am. There are a few shark species around, most notably the large, huge whale shark. I have seen the sharks around, so evidently we have a mechanic to take pictures of the live, the fish irons, of the various live things out there. Whale sharks tend to prefer the warmer waters around Stellar mm -hmm. Basin. They're completely harmless, as I'm sure you know. But do be careful around them. You wouldn't want your propellers causing them any injury. Mm -hmm. Anything else? Mammals. While still relatively scarce, I believe a few cetaceans, that's whales and such, cetaceans, can be found in the deeper waters mm -hmm. around here. Might be lucky enough to spot a pod of bottlenose dolphins or killer whales. They've been known to swim alongside the boats. As for the larger whales, I've heard humpbacks, sperm whales, and even the odd blue whale have been sighted mm -hmm. in the area. Doesn't surprise me to hear that their numbers have dwindled, what with uh, Ingfell's whaling endeavors. Hopefully their populations mm -hmm. will recover in time. About birds. Mm -hmm. yeah, you'll hear quite a variety of bird song from the island, though I suspect they're all too small to spot from your boat. There are sure to be a few larger species, gulls and ravens, loitering around the more active docks, looking mm -hmm. for morsels of food. The ruins in Devil's Spine hold a few breeding pairs of seahawks. You're bound to hear them calling to each other, though they're quite elusive. Mm -hmm. Tell me about reptiles. I'm glad you asked. Not many consider reptiles when they think of the ocean. Well, I have seen the uh, uh, alligators or crocodiles. Loggerhead turtles are common. I have seen those at least once around the Marrows and the Gale Cliffs, so they can be hard to spot mm. in the water. When it comes to larger reptiles, they don't get any bigger than the saltwater crocs. The mangroves and Twisted Strand are the mm -hmm. perfect environment for them. Well, presumably, I'll be able to sell those for additional um, monies. What we have in the way we've got well one fish and whatever's in the nets a mini-eyed mackerel and a latching snapper a couple of mutated let's see gill plates dotted with eyeballs superfluous but scanning frantically all eyes see right through you and uh, the latching snapper swollen flesh folds back over its eyes cracked lips bleed through mounted scar tissue oh, okay thanks that's Appetizing. So uh, we're going to use our teleport trick again. We teleported again. Uh, we need our lights back on, please. Lights, camera. I have a couple of items to sell at Little Marrow Island. Oh, is that another shark? Those are good uh, money makers. I want you to be careful here because I don't want to run into any of the unexpectedly unexpectedly spawned rocks that show up. Squididdlies. You got a couple things to sell to the trader. Three things. We got a ring. We got some doubloons and uh, something else. Oh yeah, a goblet. 150 bucks, guys. Torrent nothing. Uh, we want to undock and we'll go directly to Big Marrow Island. Where we will sell the rest of our catch. It's still early enough. Just before we go in, we can catch another squid diddly. Maybe two. Fresh calamari. Mm. When calamari's done right, it's freaking great. It's really easy to make not great. $352 reduce. Shipwright. 20 bucks for repairs. Currently have two research parts. We need two more. Oh, we need to go through that to even get to that. Oh, we can look at these pots. That's seven days, three per day. I've got a five by four, five by five. Hmm. We don't know what we'd get from that one. And nets. We're currently at this one. We do have enough to get. Uh, that's a, a volcanic and coastal. Currently, we only have coastal. That's mangrove and shallow. 
That would be three for coastal and shallow. That would probably be better, but I need one more research. Uh, see the shipwright. No, she doesn't sell any, so uh, we'll go call it here for the evening. It's uh, Betty by time. Sapphire ring I need to sell across the way. I haven't found any more of those maps. Uh, or I mean, scraps of paper that presumably make a map. Alright, Steel Point. I don't remember what's on Steel Point. My brain is like a freaking sieve. I know we've still got some stuff to do up here in... Um... The mangrove, so we'll head to the mangrove. Got the iridescence. Could catch something weird. Just another cod. Not weird. I'm disappointed. You have iridescence, iridescence up? I expect something special. Something nifty. Not just more cod. Shark. A bronze whaler. fish. Creepy looking, and it's going to be a a trophy viper fish. Especially creepy. Creepy with bonus points. Tuna. Hmm. Little fatty tuna belly. Sushi for dinner or well, late lunch. Uh, we want to have the crab pots up so we can see when we're in a decent spot to drop one. I missed. Seriously? Mullet. Plenty right here, so we'll drop our crab pot right there. We need a blue crab for something, so if we catch one of those, I'll have to be careful not to sell it. We'll see if we caught anything in our nets of worthwhile. Nope, just mackerel, mackerel, and mackerel. Oh, mullet. Mackerel, mackerel, and mullet. All in all, though, a 302 bucks. That's pretty good. I assume most of it's coming from the viper. It's only 32 no, most of it's coming from the big shark. I am. I, I know wealth beyond my lot in life. Uh, no, I didn't want to do that. One, two, that. She's got research. So we can now research. What was what we were looking at? Nets? I don't think I have enough space for that one. Because right now, yeah, I, I don't have enough space for that. Uncomfortably clever the way they have um, set out the uh, spacing for your various fishing accoutrements. The things you can and can't pair up. Damn it. not quite a fit. It's still a little bit early. We can catch a little bit more fish before we call it a night. Idiot. Oh, 
how an entwined mullet twisting, twitching tendrils sprout from the gill plates of this little fish. They heave in unison, moving the fish against its will. Oh, that doesn't sound wrong at all. Managed to... No, no. The crabs decided uh, a little bit too early. that I need for the last explosive. Cabin. We're 56% done with our book. Where's the last explosive? Trap the mind suckers. I need special bait in the second trap. And it's not listed. Down. I'll have to check again. I'll have to check with him first thing in the morning then because I don't remember. Hey, fat buddy. How you doing? Yeah, I get to get an early night tonight, you know. It's it's only 7.30, but... Uh, and getting up in ten and a half hours. At six in the morning. Alright, we need to go in here and find out... What the second recipe is. I need, like, one more fish... to make the bait for the third um, horrible worm monster that lives here. Airman. Talk about baiting the traps. Uh, second bait. I need whatever the hell that is. I really, really wish that the encyclopedia... So far, I think this is the only complaint I have about the game, is that the encyclopedia, there's no way to search that I can see. You know, you can sort by your location. Uh, I am currently in... Which one am I currently in? Currently in the Twisted Strand, so I can search by Twisted Strand. That's good. Uh, cabin. Twisted Strand. Ah, there is one in the mangrove. This is what I need. This one is caught here. Uh, but we don't know any more information other than it does appear here, so we're going to fish for that. At least it is caught. At least it's locally sourced. Don't hit. Don't run into stuff. Well, this is a car. sell for a few bucks. You gotta be careful as this is close to the location. This is the location where we're going to eventually try to kill the next of the big worms. There he is. sure he's not closing in on us. I figured it might be a good idea to check in his particular hunting... Ooh, I don't think that's it, but... To check in his area, that's what a, a tarp on. As it would be logical that the, the bait that I need to blow him up might be available only in his area. Ooh. 
I need two of these. That's one. Stock is low, but low means I should be able to catch one more. That I need. about where I thought we were, so I'm not completely lost. I, I really hope uh, that uh, Real Yeah doesn't enter into this, but I have no idea. Good evening, Kanucket. I have resisted so far the allure of any potential um, spoilers. Even if it's just something simple. It'll fit. If it fits, I feel constitutionally obliged to uh, fish it up. Let's see if we can figure out where we are. We would like to actually head along the outside. We'll cash in all of our daily um, catches. And we'll try to find that last fish that we're looking for. I'm getting the creepies tomorrow. No, nothing important there. We'll see if we've got any crabs in our crab pot. We have a big-ass crab in our crab pot. Uh, let's see. And a horseshoe crab. Can we... We can fit a horseshoe crab. Can we fit two horseshoe crabs? We can fit... Two horseshoe crabs. We have a full day's pile of stuff to turn in. Uh, we didn't pick up anything in the net that wasn't completely normal and expected. But that's almost 400 bucks worth of fish in the terms of not research in terms of shipping mm. repair all in terms of floating dock nah. what's up floating dock we have now completely kitted out our boat. That's all the upgrades we can do on our boat. What that also means, though, is we can now... Oh. buy more stuff at the shipyard. More research. We've got to start buying that regularly when we can. That's a three-wide light. It's going to cost us 369 Buckaroos. So you uninstall that one. Uninstall. Reinstall. Purchase. Install. Have a combined light strength of 3,000 lumens. That's another achievement for me. I'm certain you're all duly impressed. We got four now. Four, huh? Well, this will allow us to, um, no, not train up this engine yet. Eh, fine. We gotta get that one first. Twin prop. That's 36.8 kilometers per hour. It would go, what, there? 
that's like a gain of one kilometer per hour if I yoink those two. That's uh, like five. So yeah, I'm going to stick with these for now and not buy that. Uh, it's two in the morning. I think it's time for uh, us to take a little rest. All right, we know that what we're looking for, the fish we're looking for, does spawn somewhere around these collection of islands, this little archipelago, so to speak. A sergeant fish. See if we can poke our heads out a short ways away from the mangrove swamp itself and find what we're looking for. A tarpon. We've got another bubbling fishing spot over here. Just a mullet. Business in the front, party in the back. Good old fish tetras. Oh, I'll try this. If it's a fish I've already got, I will forego any further further stabs at it. This is the one. I feel it. It's not the one. off. Nope. So my uh, stratagem for the day, it may not actually turn out to have been the right call. That's more tarpon. Nope. More mullet. couple of bubbling spots here. We'll try these. I may have tried these before. You know, I don't think I need to worry about any more of the those kinds of components because I think I have uh, finished all the upgrades. I don't think there's anything else I can use those for. Or if there is, I'm not aware of it. Sergeant fish. All right, we're showing iridescence in this fishing spot. We have a trophy fish. Got it. A gleaming mullet. I have finished reading my book. What did I get out of A Plan for the Future? 15% chance to not reduce fish stocks when catching a fish with a rod. Seems okay. All right. We are headed in the correct direction, more or less. We have five fish in our nets. Uh, the pontoon ought to be over there. We'll hit the crab pot. We'll take it and pick it up. 
get it repaired. This was not a successful day. Kanucket has decided he wants to play uh, the role of an NPC in the game. Uh, I hope he is in, uh, appropriately attired in his um, robe or cassock. Hood covering, shading most of his face. But with his jagged, pointed teeth barely appearing through his pursed lips. Uh, another 300 bucks and in the net more of this just the standard stuff but it's money for nothing uh, shipyard repair me two more uh, research parts so I lose money for the day but come out ahead by two uh, research parts I'm glad she has a nice supply of research parts. We're going to need two more. One more for this engine. The twin jet drive engine. Now, god damn, we're talking. Freaking twin jets. Sorry, I'm getting worked up over the twin jets. It's It just sounds like so much fun. Well, we'll take another night's sleep here at the rickety pontoon. I embrace my sins. I just wish they, they didn't bite. When you're right, you're right. They embrace us all in our sins. It's, it's sleep in eternal slumber. Yeah. That is not dead, which can eternal lie, and with strange eons, even death may die. So there's that. I'm beginning to think that uh, other fish I'm looking for may only be catchable at night, which is uh, concerning. Well, we've got another uh, item of... value a broken monocle so you might call that a uh, magnifying lens no 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 I don't think boats actually drift but uh, around here they do fish right now. I'm looking for specific fish. Oh, dear me. That might be the sort of place where they would be available from, in which case uh, I'm going to need explosives. So I'm going to head back.
getting late again. I'll grab some more fish. Well, at least that was a, an experiment in what I need to do tomorrow in game time. Looks like a rock. Okay, try. Oh, I think that is the giant crab that looks like wreckage. There's a giant crab that looks like wreckage. Don't need wood, I don't think. I'll head back to our crab pot. Oh, oh, we'll grab this on the way. See if maybe we can. No, it'll just be another another mullet. Crab pot. One horseshoe crab. One. That's that's son, I am disappointed. We're docked again. The four in the net are just the standard stuff. That's well, two hundred and thirty two bucks. Which if she's got by any chance. Hmm. Another research. We'll just about cover that expense. Uh, we'll go to my storage. We'll drop this off. We can sell those to the trader. You don't want to hold on to the stuff if you can drop it in your storage because sometimes you run into a, a rock that jumps out in front of you and uh, some stuff in your cargo can get lost. It, it makes me sad when it happens. Uh, there's the explosive. Did she have explosives? I'd rather buy it if she's got them. Uh, she does have one thing of explosives. That'll do. Let's see. We've got four. We're, we're looking at the twin jet drive engine. You're really making it sound attractive, Kanaka. And over here is the last, is engine stack. 67.2 knots. But this one has one open spot. It'll get us almost as fast. That's 15. I think we get like nine for one that we can put in there. Uh, let us take a look. It is... 8.54, 9 in the evening. Do we have the money? Oh. The big boy engine, we do. Actually, we're going to get a significant amount more out of that. Let's see, so that's... That is like that, so that'll come out. I wonder can those go in in any way, in which case I can just leave that where it is. Um, this is $425. We get that installed. We are so fast now. Uh, I need to repair all. But that's 50, 52 knots. Call that uh, 61 knots. <coughs> 76 knots. 90 knots we can do. But that's not fast enough to run away from my sins. I'll rest. Now we'll see if we can get back to the... the place where we were, where we needed explosives.
Let's go ahead and use some explosives. There's an earth shattering. Kaboom. The debris has crumbled away. Now we have a fishing spot. Yeah, it looks like it's got equipment and stuff, not fish. That's disappointing. Uh, well, we'll get it. I haven't seen a need for finished metal for quite a while. not the hoped for result, I have to say. Ah, but you see, judgment implies some sentient applying rational criteria. That was a, oh, that's a trophy tarpon. Nope. Yep, that's the refined metal I just picked up was just lost. You get a little bit too excited. You lose your cool for a sec. You run into something. some night fishing. What could possibly go wrong with night fishing in this game? Oh, it's it's a saltwater croc. How do I take its picture? I have no idea how I actually do anything to take the picture. She gave me the camera. I don't know where it is. How to use it. God damn it. My assumption is that's worth uh, some bucks. Oops, oops, oops. Again, we're almost. I don't think we need any more of that. There's another gar. Just Gar. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm just not having any luck. It may just be a night fish. Uh, where are we exactly? Okay, we don't want to go that way. my crab. We'll sell and repair. And we're going to do some night fishing. I don't know. I have done very little night fishing in this game because scared. Four in the net are the standard stuff. 170. 47 to fix the damage that I that was inflicted upon me it was not my fault okay I don't know if uh, the fishing changes much if at all or how much at night figure fish until midnight. That's the fish we need. That was the magic.
We got a couple of catfish. We want to keep one of those. Obviously. Can't see very well. Okay, good. We will check the crab pot again. That's what we're talking about. Nice, ginormous Krabby von Krabbenstein. All right, fish market. We don't want to sell all, right? Right. We'll sell one catfish. And the big-ass mud crab and the one little guy. There. The small amount of damage done. And we'll sleep. Oh. After we buy another research part. That gets expensive after a while, but about the only way to get it, in my experience. Uh, my storage. My storage. And we'll sleep. get the third bait put together and we'll knock out the last of the critters here. Mind eaters I think uh, the guy calls them. They're these horrific giant worm things with growths on their quote unquote heads. They're, they're pretty awful looking. Airmen. Let's talk about the bait. Da -da. Some bait for the second one. <laughs> that should do it. I'll just mix these in here, load this into a trap, then get well clear of it. When the trap springs, I'll fire on it with the mortar. Make sure you bring back proof. Oh, it's it's beyond deserved. What's on the other side of deserved? You know, undeserved. Uh, kind of neutral, deserved, well-deserved. What's out here? All right, where's the third trap? Right, and then the left. There. No, I think the next one. Will give us a straighter run. No, 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 no. Really, I didn't know boats could drift in the car sense of the word drift. I knew they could drift in the tide, say. Cage is suspended. Load the trap with bait. As you load the bait, you should probably move away. There it is. It's the horrible worm thing. It's eating the bait. Or taking the bait. Oh, the big trap has caught it. It's pulling it down because it's big and strong. He fired the artillery and earth shattering kaboom. I have to get the uh, proof. Because the proof is in the pudding, and I'm looking forward to some mind-eater pudding. Uh, mind-sucker. I'm sorry, mind-sucker. Mmm, a chunk of flesh. I believe we have cleared out the mind-suckers. I don't suppose there's anything else in here worth catching. I'm here, you know. Catch a couple things. He's going to be so happy. <laughs> A 
are things going? I have the creature's corpse to talk to. Mm. Let's see it then. You drop the large, bloodied carcass in front of the airman, his eyes filled with sadistic delight. Is it really sadistic, though? Looks like he's lost his arm, he lost all of his buddies. Is it sadistic? Vengeful, sure. He bends down and plunges his knife into the soft flesh. It falls away before the blade, revealing a glint of metal. With a sickening tear, he wrests it from where it was embedded. The flesh of the creature, he holds it aloft. You recognize it as a necklace, glistening in gore. Mm -hmm. Well, fisherman, some fortune at last. This ought to fetch a decent price from the right collector. Here, why don't you take it? He stands back from the corpse. A melancholic look comes over his face. Mm -hmm. And now? Well, that's that, I suppose. Oh, what will you do now? Uh. I can't say for sure. I thought I'd be asking you for an escort away from this place, but this has become somewhat of a home for me. It doesn't feel right to leave my brothers here. I think I shall stay a while longer. In the meantime, I can make some special bait for you. It ought to help with your fishing. Can you make up some bait for me? Hmm. Here, this was left over from the other bait we made. Mixed bait can be used to attract all manners of nearby species. Let's go ahead and store that. Anyway, uh, we can, right now we can make some fresh stuff if you like. I'll need some fish from you first. Any type will do, but the more you give me, the more bait I can make. Well, this is all I've got right now. So. Let me just grind these up. Won't be a moment. This is what I could make. Take it all. Don't keep here. Bait. I have lost the ability bait to toss bait over. <laughs> this game just keeps on going. Now, they go crazy for that stuff. Day, night, doesn't seem to matter. All sorts of fish usually show up. So in the future, I can bring him bait. Uh, I'm going to AFK for a second. I'll be right back. I need to refill my coffee cup. Back and I have remembered to remove the AFK. Go me. Just to be on the safe side, I don't think you can lose those because that's a quest item. But I'd rather not find out. That's another relic for the collector. I have no idea if uh, items sell for more in, in distant locations, essentially. Ah, we got another crab. Another big, juicy, delicious crab.
See if she happens to have. Mm. Oh, she does not have happen to have any more research at present. There's the camera. Damn it. All right. Now I know. Should have. I should have known. We've teleported. The ruined mansion. The collector. What is it? Uh, I was expecting that he wanted that relic. I don't have it in my inventory. Now I do. There we go. This time for sure. You enter the house, carrying the ornate necklace. The collector recognizes it almost immediately. Ah, an excellent find. Demands pride of place in my collection. He sweeps aside the chains. Relinquish the necklace. That's the achieve. He sweeps aside some scraps in a dusty table. Candle wax pooling in its corners. He places the necklace carefully in the clearing. And I suppose you'll be demanding recompense as well. Once more, he opens his book, dust pouring from the pages as he reads aloud. You begin to feel weak, but you're rooted to the spot, knees on the verge of buckling. As he finishes speaking, you feel blood rushing back to your legs. A strange feeling of power grows in your chest. We're so close. One more remains. I loathe to suggest it, but the abyssal plain on the approach to the devil's spine is a likely candidate. See what you can find. I'll mark the location on your map where you can begin to search. Anything else? The words you read from that book, what did they do to uh, me? It holds power from the deep. I merely extended its powers towards you. Is there one particular you wish to know about? Well, you just gave me atrophy. This phrase instantly culls the closest shoal of fish, readying them for swift reaping. It can be heard from a great distance, so you need not be close to your victim. But the population is unlikely to recover some, from such vile trauma. Use it sparingly. So I can use it to nuke an entire location of fish, pick it all up, but all the fish will never come back. Oh, I actually wanted to check one other thing. There's a workshop here. I've never been able to do anything with the workshop. It's still locked. There's so many little bits and pieces of story stuff going on. It's hard to know which ones are associated with which thing. Ah, near the ancient temple. Imagine my lack of surprise. We'll catch a few fish. It's not much, but, you know, it's honest work. Maybe catch a shock while we're at it. Good evening. How you doing? Been a bit. We have to squididdlies yet? Squididdlies! Alright. Uh, we'll see. Is there a storage here? I can't remember. Uh, there is a buy storage. Okay. Uh, we've got two things that he'll want to buy the broken monocle and the sapphire ring, I think, are about it. The trader? Uh, 66 bucks. I'm wealthy. Don't sweat it then. You've got to do what's best for you. No need to apologize for that. An additional squididdly. Gotta go. 
No slow. Ooh, iridescent. Not sure what the iridescent means. All right, I caught a snag squid. Tasting tongues writhe wildly about sets of yellow, crooked teeth. The top row are flattened like human molars. Not creepy in any way at all. Fishmonger is going to give me 400 bucks for all of this stuff. Nice. Nice. Hmm. We've got the lights maxed out. We've got really good engines. We can get better trawl nets, I suppose. I thought I saw something about that for New World mounts coming in. I'm not sure it's the right decision. Personally, I would like to see point-to-point um, -point transportation like Lord of the Rings stables. Basically, you catch a carriage from one town to another town. That would be enough moving around, I think, to cover most of the bases. I think mounts are really going to shrink the scale of the game a lot. They did to some degree in Guild Wars 2, but I think it'll be much more so in New World. Uh, I currently have only one research part. I don't see myself getting this, because that's oceanic, shallow, and coastal. I'm currently using this one. Uh, I don't need the mangrove anymore. Mm, that's something to think about. Yeah, uh, I mean, they certainly they need to keep growing uh, the, the scope of the game, I think. Otherwise, I think it just sits and, and players lose any motivation to keep playing. Uh, let's go ahead and prepare our stuff. Ship right. Got all the right. There is nothing else to do for upgrades. Let's see. I think we're going to sleep. And we're going to see what we get out of fishing by the ancient temple. We're going to want to drop crab pot. Get to slightly deeper water. That ought to do. Ah, uh, this woman might have uh, more research stuff for me. Builder. No, I guess I got everything done for her then. Yeah, I guess so. All right. All right, the temple, the ancient temple. What could possibly go wrong to going to an ancient temple? <laughs> I'm sure it'll be fine. Oh, 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 oh. I thought I heard... Okay. Uh, camera? Uh, zoom? Take photo. Screenshot taken for Dredge. Oh, this is how you take in-game screenshots. <laughs> uh, okay. That's clever. Uh, we'll keep that there, I think. That's funny. Blackfin tuna. 
I assumed you'd be able to just like sell the pictures for money or achieves or something, but it looks like that's just the mechanic for taking screenshots. Although that other may be true as well. Well, here's the temple. Gate. It's a lovely place, really. I don't think are the statues. I don't know what it's looking for. Holds a stone crucible. Stone columns, swarm of small creatures. All right, th that's the information on how to get away from the asshole fish here. And the fanatic. No, nothing. Sea robins. Seldom seen without the accompaniment of a sea batman. That's right, they did allow um, multiple characters on the same server. Do they have to be in the same faction? I don't remember. It's a frilled shark. I don't recall that being needed for anything. Is this maybe what I'm searching for? Probably not. But it's floating here, so I'm going to pick it up. Ah. We have another message from the past. Yesterday was the reading of his mother's will. Most of the remaining estate went directly to him, of course. But to my surprise, she bequeathed me her pocket watch. Curious. I'm not fond of the thing, but I know that taking it will mean a lot to him. I cannot but feel it's some veiled jab at me from beyond the grave. She was the type to do such a thing. Was I late on some occasion? I cannot recall. Ah, okay. Well, let's see. It should be closer to the temple. Whatever it is, the thing that I'm looking for in Abyssal Depths. That's going to be another one of those. You said it was in Abyssal Depths. But this is not Abyssal at all. No, well, that's some wood. And that's... Uh, spare parts, or scrap metal. That's another one of the ghost things. Should be right behind me. Huh. Maybe I have to finish out doing this stuff for the guys here. Odd. I am somewhat confused. Uh, well, I think. Head over here. I'll try this. Grab another one of these big freaking eels. You're gonna make me move something manually, aren't you? You sure are. Jerks. Fish Tetris, I tell ya. Let's see if we can grab anything here. We need one of these for something. Don't remember what it was. 
Oh, an infernal eel. That's not the one we needed. That thing's pretty terrifying. Alright, so we caught the infernal eel grown fat from countless corpses that rest in the deep. The harbinger of a sick mercy for lost souls. Wow. Okay. Dark. Thirty-seven bucks. Nice chunk of change. Ah. We'll repair. She's got two research. We're gonna buy. That's gonna put us negative for the day, but well worth it. Ah, and now I can get bait from vendors as well. Now that I know how to make it, more or less. So we're back up to three research. All right, we've got engines. I can't really see ourselves going to the engine stack as we don't gain much in kilometers or knots, I mean. It's 15 knots higher than this, but this one has uh, an additional nine in that space right there. So it's 61 versus 67 for five research and, and money. I'm not buying it, literally. Rods, that's five for coastal, oceanic, and shallow harvesting platform. I don't think so. Well, we're gonna need both of these crab pots to get to that one. But three would get us the large trawl net, coastal and shallow. I don't think we've got space for it though. have to remove our winch, and our winch is currently our only way of fishing in the Bissell and Hadal areas. Control net is coastal. That means we're still getting coastal. About 12 fish per day. That seems like, I guess if I'm doing nothing but driving around, 12 fish per day. I'm not sure. But we will go with the massive crab pot for now. sleep. All right, we are. Catch a blue crab back over there. Light the statues. I don't think I've seen a way to light the statues, but I haven't been over there for a while, so we're going to take a look. Those are marked on the map. There's one right here. I think that's the statue right there. Nope! <laughs> I, I didn't touch a thing. Stone Shrine, upright slab, but too heavily right. I need the second crab to light this one. Presumably a deep water crab spot. Let's go fishing in there. Got to be really careful. That's a Bissell. 
life is is pretty abyssal sometimes, isn't it? Yeah. There's the asshole fish on the right. You see them darting around in the upper right-hand corner there. Those are the ones where I figured out how to get rid of them and then found the instructions on how to get rid of them. It was nice to know I had figured it out first, but you know, still a little on the disappointing side. All right, so this island on the other side, or no, that island. Check that out. So it should be that island there on the other side. Don't recognize that. Oh, it's a treasure. A sextant. Huh. I wasn't expecting that. Nobody expects the sextant inquisition. Their main weapons are fear, surprise, ruthless efficiency, and almost fanatical devotion to the Pope and their nice red robes. For any not aware, that's a Monty Python. got asshole fish. This is going to be the first time we're going to probably pick up asshole fish. We'll see if we can get rid of them. They don't like they don't like the volcanic. So it didn't follow me through. Here's the second one. Or third one, I guess. A stone shrine. It just needs any kind of fish to fill that up. An upright slab bears a carving. Two malformed fish riding under the sun. A lower slab holds two shallow gro grooves. Huh. Alright, the other one is on the outside. Of the next island. That is a trophy fish worth more. That's the mother fish. Gotta get away. Give me some volcanic water, please. That should discourage them. That's the, the, the third of the uh, the altars, the statues, whatever the hell they are. Statues, I think. Torches? Something. There, something. I don't call them that whatever. Stone Shrine. I have both of those fish? Really? I happen to have both of those fish. The rock splits with a mighty crack. It crumbles away. Fathomless flame. Okay. Two refined pieces of metal and a discovery. I have the fathomless flame. What do we have here? More treasure. Wow, that one's quite difficult, actually.
That's treasure I can do without. Uh, asshole fish waiting. We're going through. Return of the asshole fish. Alright, back. Honey, I'm home. Yeah, that's, uh, no problem at all. Don't, I clicked the wrong thing. Alright, I think we want to hold on to the fathomless flame. find space for the item cargo. Really? Oh, it, it won't work. Uh, okay, I think I'm going to discard that. That's a hydraulic rod. We've got the fathomless winch. That is abyssal, hadal, and oceanic. That's just oceanic, so we'll get rid of that. That fish, which we can sell, and in the nets, we've got a bunch of snake mackerels we can sell. Mm. 191 bucks. I, I've not yet seen swimming be enabled in this game. Mm. Also, I would generally think it's probably not the best idea. Let's go back to my storage, put these away. We're now back at the four research. So we can't get this one until we get this one. That is the reinforced crab pot. It is a six by five. It catches about three a day and it lasts for nine days. Can't quite get that yet. Uh, anything else? Uh. Shipyard, we want to repair our stuff. Figure out where we want to go next with our stuff. Passages now, pursuits. I need... Uh, I need more stone tablets. Don't know how many. I found two. I need to light the statues with the fathomless flame. So I guess that there was a statue back there I should have lit at the place where I found the first fathomless flame. No? Maybe not. Where are the statues? No, no, the statues... Ah, oh, got it. The statues are on the temple. So I need to get the other two. Still need to catch a blue crab. I'm still searching for relics. Need to find the watch in the Devil's Spine. That's abyssal by the Devil's Spine along the way. Um, I still need to catch oarfish, gulper eel, goliath tigerfish, and a coelacan. And deliver a rotting eel. Thank you. And a cusk eel. And the statues. But. So I have to find an abyssal somewhere around here that I can fish for. And hopefully catch uh, what the collector on Steel. No, Blackstone Island is looking for. So we'll try that again more tomorrow. possible that that also may uh, be a night only occupation
We're looking for abyssal spots. That's volcanic. is deep, but it's considered coastal. Snake mackerel. It's supposed to be abyssal, right around here. This is volcanic. I've been called that before. Doesn't hurt me much. <laughs> All the other kids called me shallow. I think they're onto something. I mean, we're pretty much right on the X that he gave us on the map. And none of these spots. This is um, is for fishing up materials. This is too, I think. Now, yeah, those are both for fishing up materials, but I have no use of materials anymore. And this is volcanic. And this will give me another one of these pale skates. So maybe at night? So, uh, we'll head a little further out to sea. Just a little. Spend some time running around out here. This is Hadal. A rat tail. Personally, I always thought that was an uh, appalling um, hairstyle, but evidently it's also a fish. My apologies to anyone who uh, is currently wearing a rat tail. This is coastal. That's uh, a whale. Come up again? Can I get a shot? It looks like the answer is no. Uh, now that's just going to be another one of those. Let's get this back to the light because we're going to be doing some night fishing or trying to. Not Night Swimming, that's a, a great song by uh, R.E.M. This is Night Fishing, entirely different. Somebody looking for a cusk eel. I think somebody was. Cusk eel to the figure in red. All right, well, we'll be heading back there soon. 
That's the dock. I think that's materials fishing. Yep, that's cloth. Materials and materials. Oh, now I'm, now I'm only completely hearing whispers and stuff, so that's fine. Totally fine. Didn't freak me out at all. I am not afraid. What? It, it asked me my favorite color. So we don't want to sell the Cusky. We'll put that into storage for now. If I had space, this is where my Cusky eel would go. Oh, I put it back in. Oh. Yes, I did. Aha. Uh -huh. The rest of it I can sell, I think. Yep. Good money here out in the volcanics. Mm. Uh, we'll sleep here. We'll get our cusk eel back out. Number of times I hit the wrong button is large. I'm gonna have to get rid of more of this stuff sooner or later. But now, not now. All right. So uh, that's banish. Banishing words can dispel most evils for a time. Uh, manifest. We need to uh, teleport ourselves. Because we are magic fishermen. The guy on the red robe is down here somewhere. On one of these islands. I have no idea which, because he's one of the first NPCs outside of the sort of main cluster of islands I ever ran into. Might as well do some fishing while I'm out here. I mean, that's my job. I am a fisherman. Oh, grotesque mackerel. Corrupted scales and bulbous eyes. You've never seen anything like it before. Great. That, is, that doesn't look like it's the right guy in a robe. That guy in his robe must have gotten everything. Where's the guy? Oh, good. I damaged my home. Where's the guy in the red robes then? Red robes, red robes. That's, that, that was the guy I was thinking I had to deliver this to. Now I don't know where. Over here, maybe? Probably not. But maybe? Oceanic perch. That's where an oceanic sits, by the way. I haven't been over here for a while, but that's not the dude in the red robes. I don't. Remember where he hangs out? Oh man, am I bad at this. I'm suddenly bad at this. I didn't used to be bad at this. I very early on failed almost never. Whoops. Oh, 
a small little, you know, water tornado. Blackmouth salmon. Up, 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 up. We've got a little sparkly spot. A wreck fish. Appropriate. I fished it out from a wreck. Okay, I'll, I'll buy that for a dollar. I've suddenly suddenly gotten really bad at fishing. Oh, good. A decaying blackmouth. Is there someone who needed a decaying blackmouth? A shimmering blackness permeates the flesh of this relentless fish. Muscles atrophied and decaying, but still it swims on. Thank you for the imagery. Did not need. No, rotting conger eel. That was a decaying blackfish. The cusk eel. That thing's going to go real bad before I find the dude in uh, Red Row. I have no idea what the hell that is. Stonefish. Problem is... That I may have to actually... Came for some packed explosives? I'll take one. Don't want to rest here. Oh, it's going to be more the same. We're going to teleport back. Left mouth shark. Large body bisected by an enormous grinning maw. Teeth stretch down forever into the blackness of its large gullet. Okay. So that's not creepy. Maybe a little. A little bit. Uh, somewhere out here we've got our uh, crab pot. Don't we? It's it needs repair and it's full and I don't have enough space. So what I'm going to do is we're going to two phase this. We're going to head back. We're going to sell stuff and we're going to then hit head back for our crown pot. No worry if if it's after midnight. That shouldn't be a problem. Uh, but we do need to put this thing into my storage where it will no doubt rot beautifully. Uh, and the rest of it we're going to sell for almost 600 bucks. And we're going to real quick go and get our crab pot. And hopefully not run into, oh, I don't know, a bunch of rocks. Frankly, my money's on the rocks. I'll take all the crabs and pick up the crab pot. Get some, don't know what the hell that is. Some kind of eel. Gray eel. Maybe a uh, squididdly. Something slithers into my car into my cargo hold. That's not something that happens. Now, there's the cleft mouse shark. What? Oh, the fiddler crab is infected. Yeah, relatively normal. Yeah. Uh oh, it, it, it's uh, that's not supposed to happen. I don't think. Uh 
110. The infected one goes for 13 bucks. They, they, there's still a market for the infected ones, which is pretty awful. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say that's that's pretty awful. Uh, I was gonna get a new trolling net, wasn't I? Improved. No, I was gonna buy a report. No, I was going to research the last one. No, pot. I was gonna yeah, research the last of the pots. I don't have enough research parts. That's unfortunate. Don't, don't suppose you've got one uh, sitting there and you don't even have that now. Rats. Uh, let's see if we can, what we can do with my storage here. Uh, what can we get rid of? The basic crab pot. We don't need that anymore. I don't think I can sell those. But let's see if I can sell those. I don't know who I'd sell those to. The ship, right? Uh. No, that's not going to work. Um, well, I guess we're going to discard them then. I haven't the space. Can't afford to keep such trash around in my storage. I, I, I need it for valuables. And the like. Dry dock we are completed with. Shipwright, nothing else we can buy at present, or need to buy at present. We don't want the trawl net. That's the one we've already got. We need one more research to buy the next tier of trawl net. We're all lighted up, which as best we can. On an island between Twisted Strand and Devil's Spine. Twisted Strand and Devil's Spine. Twisted Strand and Devil's Spine. So, here or here, or here or here. Probably there. Well, I'm gonna sleep. We'll see, and we'll see if we can track him down. We'll put this in here. Lovely day out, don't you think? Nah. Oh, I think more likely are those. Sailfish. Those are probably worth a pretty penny. But we do want to look because we've got crab. We need to catch another of those really freaky looking crabs. Like, is there anything right about there? Alright. Let's see if we can find the guy in the red robe. I see a guy in a red robe. So it turns out, uh, sometimes if you actually like read stuff, yeah, I know who think who think of that. <coughs> Snake mackerel, also known as the pliskin fish. Here first. Missed it. Guys. 
Deliver the vessel. Did I not put that thing into my inventory? The... Tell me it like got old. It got old and rotten, I'm guessing. It did rot. There it is. Fishing around here? I can't even remember. I think so. Well, it's about to become night, so we'll see if we can catch another one. Uh, we need to discard that. Because it's rotten to the core. Uh, 300 bucks. Mm. Repairs. Research parts. We've got sufficient research parts now for the pot, the reinforced crab pot. A researcher in pots. I have researched all pots. Go me. and buy a bigger pot then. Um, it's in the ship. Oh. Those are nets. Those are lights. Where are the pots? Where are the pots? Ancients. Fishing. Those are the trolls. Those are the nets. Let me get the crab pots. We don't. certain places sell the crab pots. But we're going to try and fetch that, uh, catch that particular eel that rotted on us. That's not going to do it. I believe it was only at night time. Around here, I think. That's an infernal eel. Cusk eel. All right, now we're back to the creepy guy over there. Yep, heading the right way. Frankly, he seems like the kind of guy who'd like rotten fish. 
But that does answer a question I had, which is, I wonder if, uh, how long fish lasts. The answer is, eh, not as long as you want, maybe. There's the, there's the dude in red. Deliver the vessel. And here's your costume. He draws a ceremonial knife from the robe and slices the fish, cutting out the heart. They place it on a stand in front of them. Bring down the sky. Another shape on a scroll. This one looks like a sailfish. I had one of those. I don't anymore. That's what he needs next is a sailfish. But what we're going to try and grab next is our crab pot. And if there's anything in it worthwhile, we'll teleport back to the area near home and then get home. It should be right there. Pfft. That's it. A scarlet prawn. I'm so glad. Right, we'll go ahead and pick it up. And... Teleport back to home. Or close enough. To near home. To go slow. You don't want to accidentally catch a, a rock. Nice big shock. I caught me a wicked shock. Squididdly, I think. Trophy Arrow Squid. We got three in the net. Just average stuff. Mackerel and one squid. But the whole thing is worth... Three. Oh, there's the fishmonger store. So that's the reinforced crab pot. That's the big one. that I wanted. We can sell that to him. Excellent. Let's see. Uh, the shipwright will repair our stuff. For research. We currently have one. We've got all of the rods. Nope, nope. We've got the big harvesting platform to go. Nets would be next. Well, I think I'm going to call it here. It was a good break point uh, for the evening. Uh, maybe back tomorrow. May take a day off. Uh, if I am back, or if I'm not back until Monday, regardless, I'll be back playing Dredge again. And it'll be at the usual time. 5 p.m. Pacific. 8 p.m. Eastern. Uh, I hope you had some fun tonight. I am still enjoying this game. It's weird. I've so far managed to not look up anything, any spoilers on the internet. I do really wish it had a search feature for the encyclopedia. Other than that, I don't really have any complaints about it. It's smartly done. I enjoy a smart game. And this one's simple and straightforward, but it's smartly put together. So, uh, back either tomorrow or Monday. I hope the rest of your Saturday evening, yes, Saturday evening, I do believe, uh, goes great. Uh, and that your Sunday's nice, too. Back in a day or two. Hopefully you'll see me then. Have a great night tonight. Take care. And ciao for now. Good night, guys.